Hello fellow Robloxians! This video will teach you how to make a Game Pass Give Tools. Shall we? First, I'm going to insert a script into the server script service, and in this case, it doesn't matter what you name it, but I'll be naming it Game Pass Tools. So now, uh, I actually made an outline for the script, so I can better explain the process and so that we can do things step by step. So let me go through it real quick. We're going to set some variables that we'll be using, then we'll set our Game Pass ID directory. Then we need a player added event, so this will run whenever a player comes in the game. And we need a character added event, so that this code will run whenever the character loads. And we want to uh, go through the Game Pass ID directory through this. We want to loop through the Game Pass IDs. Then we want to check if the player has the Game Pass in any of those entries in the directory. And then if so, we want to clone the tools and set the parent to the player's back. So let's start with our variables. For sure, we're going to be using the marketplace service, so local ms equals game colon get service marketplace service. We also want to use replicated storage, so local storage equals game colon get service replicated storage. I also want to use uh, a folder inside the replicated storage, so local tools equals storage colon wait for child tools. So to remain consistent, let's insert a folder into the replicated storage and name it tools. Now we need our game pass ID directory with its corresponding tools. So local dir equals uh, curly braces and brackets. We need now our uh, game pass id so i got my game pass id and i'm gonna paste it inside the brackets now we'll set it equal to another set of curly braces and inside these curly braces we are we are going to refer to the tools we want to assign to this game pass id now i don't have any tools in my folder yet so i'm going to look into the toolbox and uh, get some tools now i'm sure you have your own tools so you don't have to follow these steps that i am taking just paste your tools into the uh, tools folder that you should have made by now. And there we go. So now I can refer to them inside these curly braces. I'll type in tools.classicsword, comma, tools.rocketlauncher. Now we need our player added event. So game.players.playerAdded, colon, connect, parenthesis function, parenthesis player, close parenthesis, and then at the very end we need an end with a closing parenthesis. So now we need a character added event. So it's player dot character added, colon connect, function, char, or car, I don't know, however you want to pronounce it. And we need another end at the end with a closing parenthesis. Now let's do a four key value in pairs loop through the game pass ID directory. So four key comma value in pairs parentheses dir do and then we need another end at the end. Uh, before that though, before the next step, let's set our variables. So local ID equals key, since this is a game pass ID and this is the key of this dictionary entry. Now we also want the tab or table and set it equal to the value since this is a, a table and these are the tools that we are going to clone. Alright. Now checking if the player has a game pass, what we'll do is uh, if ms colon player owns asset parentheses and the arguments should be player and id. So this is uh, the player and the game pass id. So if the player owns the asset then let's set another end at the end. We'll clone the tools and set the parent to the player's backpack. 
Now, since this is a table, what we have to do is uh, 40 equals 1, remember, tab do. Make sure that it adds an M for you. Um, local clone equals tab t colon clone parentheses and set the parent of clone to the player colon wait for child backpack. Now we should be all set. Let's uh, test it out. Thank you for watching! Please subscribe for more tutorials, leave a like, or comment down below if you're having any trouble. Also, I really appreciate your likes and comments on my previous video. You guys are awesome!